Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to check the elevation in Google Earth. It's pretty quick and easy. So let's jump right in. Now, of course, you have to have the Google Earth app here on your iPhone, Android, or on a computer. It doesn't really matter which one. To see the elevation of any spot on Earth, let's just navigate to, say, the Himalayan mountains here. So let's scroll in here and you can see this is the border between Nepal and China. And say I am going to be visiting this little campsite and I want to know where the elevation is, or what the elevation is for this campsite. So I can zoom in and all I have to do is tap on that specific spot. And if I open it up, it won't give me the elevation of there. Unfortunately, I have to tap right next to it. So I can tap right next to it. And you can see if I drop a pin in Google Earth, it shows me the latitude and longitude as well as the elevation. I can tap on the little drop down if I wanted to change it to uh, meters, kilometers, nautical miles, inches, feet, yards, miles, whatever you want on here but basically it defaults to meters. So again, I can just zoom out and say we're in the United States and we wanted to check the elevation of Miami right by the beach here. So you can just tap and hold again and it'll drop a pin and the elevation of this specific spot is negative. 0.32 meters, indicating that it is under sea level. So another cool thing is if we go over to the ocean, I can tap and hold here, and you can see it will show me the elevation underwater. This is essentially the elevation of the ground underneath the ocean. You can see at that point, the elevation is negative 0.86 meters, indicating that basically the water depth is 0.86 meters. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. And I'll catch you on the next one.